live from beautiful State of America Stadium in Chuckett, South Carolina, where they love to say, keep pounding, ever since the Tommy DeFist incident back in 13. We all remember where we were that day. I still remember the beautiful screams. Yeah, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The New Orleans Zombies battle the Carolina Panzers. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs. Newtons, I'd like to fuck. He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you half-wit. Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime MILF lingerie girls team. What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all. Ho ho, va 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 voom. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. He's leaving it all out on the field today. And there's his large intestines over there, his liver. I think his spleen is stuck on that guy's cleat. No, that's a gallbladder. Ah, uh, my bad. And it's first and ten. He picks up ten yards on that play. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Hey. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. What a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 QB passes it for maybe a yard. They've got to open up the offense here, Bricks. Second down and two. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Attack on the QB. He's only, if this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! And that'll bring up third down and seven. was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked what are you doing then? Run. And it's first and ten. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Yeah. 
First down and a mile. And Briggs, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. And that'll bring up second and one. Well, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. You want to do some better time. Second down in a very lot. What is this, 80s wrestling? Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. The QB decides to throw the ball away. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Still bet, Jarks. Yo, guys, suck. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Gets the ball. Get the first down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was! Second down and more than the QB would like. Third down and three. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. First and eight to go. Holds him to a four yard pickup there. And that'll be second down and four. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game.
When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. through the defense for a big game. Like some pizza. Yeah, I'm sure you got pizza. Uh, and burritos. Okay, you make a good point. Oh, oh, and pickles. Gotta have pickles. Well, that's a lovely shake for the punter today. He just put his team in the hole. They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Well, the QB is dinking and dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> One yard on that pass. Second down and nine. And the wow, he took like a thousand volts of shock there. They did that to my Aunt Lizzie because she thought she was the reincarnation of Lizzie Borden, the ex murderer. Did the shock treatment work? Well, after she killed four of the doctors and zapped her, they never bothered her again. So, yeah, I, I guess it worked for her. Way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go. He's unstoppable. And he finds out. First and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. And 
was a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Margaret, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. Second down and a lot. And he's running like a moose right now. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Third down and six. in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. Second down and five. Deflated the quarterback's balls right there. The QB saved some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. Defense gives up five yards there. If they don't, and they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the NFL, you moron. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And that'll be their final timeout. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Grim, can I keep... 
job. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And that's the end of the second quarter. Seminole will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Second down and ten. Nice pickup for six yards. Third and four. And he was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. And that's why he's on defense, schmuck. I'd be impressed if he splits the upright from this far away, Bricks. If he doesn't, they're going to split his skull wide open. The kick is good! Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. I thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. I'm a hell of a Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Oh, man, what a throw. That sonic blast just cleared the field for the receiver. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the now. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> Third down, and, and the defense jumps off sides trying to mutilate the kid. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. I don't know which way you are. Third down and nine. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. They're going for two. The QB threads the nail for two points. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Intercepted. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. The return man catches the ball. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Oh, crash, bang, pow! Huh? Oh, you ordering Chinese food again, Grim? Huh? Hey, give me the bang, pow chicken. That stuff is good. And don't forget my fucking egg rolls this time. Two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. First and goal. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. First and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. 
And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that too fast. <laughs> And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. That's a real buzzkill. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? And it's first and ten. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. Second down and six. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell here. It might be time to change the channel. I think Heidi's playing on Superstation WKRP. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. <laughs> Man, this coach must have played too many video games. You got to punt it here. Come on. Just saved a touchdown on that deflection. And it's first and ten. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Third and two. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know? Good communication is important. First down and three. <laughs> Second down and six. <laughs>
should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. More speed. Engage. What are you trying to impress your nerd fan base? First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, tell him me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. done for a first down. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Quinn? Aren't we all? And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but... This guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. And that, ladies and mutants, is how you recover an onside kick. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Second and three. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. And he picks up two yards on the catch. Third down and nine. A nice run there for eight yards. It's all about who can control the line of scrimmage on these short yardage fourth down plays. Usually it's on fourth down, they run it down the defense's throat and pick it up. First and ten. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I top off my drink. Grab me a scotch while you're up. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. He's not going down. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and kill. Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Uh, same as Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Now there are 
some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sit. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just kidneys. He'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. for the extra point. It's good. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. First and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. They need to call an attack ref dirty trick and stop this or they're going to lose. Not like they need any help with that, though, Grim. These guys are doing fine by themselves. They're back up here on first, and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> first down in a mile. One yard is better than nothing, but not by much. And that's the last time out. The D has to either break the clock or the offense if they want to win. Hey, as long as something gets broke, right? Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack.